Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's been a little while. Now, I know a lot of you are expecting a video on the tube valve that's over there, but um, that's gonna be a little while. Um, today we got a new project, and this actually isn't my car, uh, nor my dad's. It is my little brother's first car. It is a 94. 94 GT. Here, how about you How about you talk about it? Hi, I'm Brad, Blake's little brother. This is my first car, 94 Mustang GT, and I'm gonna show you around it. Let's get started. Here's the trunk. As you can see, it's a bit rusty. Um, it's like the only bit of rust in the car. Yep, frame's all good. It's not the best over here, but it's like it's solid underneath. Get a look in there. The interior's seen better days. Uh, a lot of it's missing, or just gross. We're gonna do a complete uh, interior overhaul. We're gonna make everything black. That's a 5-0 right there, buddy. Well, uh, last guy he had it, he said it was locked. He had it, he, they were working on it for about a week, but they uh, they just gave up on it, I guess. And it was in his yard, taking up space, so. I think he said it was knocking, too, when he got it. So, uh, what's what's the plan engine-wise for this car? Well, we're gonna get a 302 out of an Explorer, hopefully, and uh, maybe down the line, cam it. You gonna supercharge it? Possibly. I want to get a Vortec, maybe. You're too young for that. We don't have any parts right now, but we have is some paint that definitely needs washed. It's gross. I mean, the hood is like clapped. Like that's that's like, but no, it's 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 kind of nasty. Hood is or, or roof is also terrible. So yeah, she needs a little bit of a bath, and so she probably a little bit, a little bit of a bath, a lot of bit. Already. It actually is. The paint ain't bad. I mean, it's terrible. I mean, look at all this. I heard that the dog scratched the. Bumper. Yeah, didn't he say like the previous owner like had a dog yeah. and it just went ham on that bum bumper? Well, I got it. I'm uh, just gonna go ahead and say real quick, these rims are definitely going. They're the most grossest thing we've ever seen in my life. They look better on camera than they are in real life. Just trust me on that one. Set up the air compressor because the uh, tires are flat. Decided before we completely wash it, um, we just rinsed it off and I just was like, yo, let's, let's air the tires real quick. There's probably something we don't wanna forget because then we can at least clean the tires that aren't gonna be on it. There we go. The pressure's going down quick. Oh, it airs up fucking quick too. That's what we're using, guys. Wash and wax by White Diamond, platinum. How this stuff? It's good stuff. Next, like McGuire's Gold Class. This is my go-to. Probably even more so. Keep going. A little more. That's good. Now, we probably shouldn't wash this car, just like touch wash it immediately. We probably should do like some sort of touchless wash and a pressure washer. If we really cared, we would. But the thing is, this windshield's getting replaced, um, hood's re getting replaced, obviously, bumper, um, and the whole car's probably gonna get painted at some point. I mean, honestly, we're probably just gonna fucking spray paint it for the time being or plastic dip or something. So, um, the finish we're not too cared about. We just wanna get it nice and sanitized and whatever you may call it. You're gonna grab your sponge, you're gonna like mix all this solution in and get some suds on there and whatnot. This one you're gonna go in here, and you're gonna do like long streaks, okay? Just like that. You're gonna make sure you get every inch. You're probably gonna get all scrub a little bit so that way you get it nice and washed because it is indeed gross. So. Alright guys, just wrapped up washing it. It looks a lot better. Um, I mean, <laughs> it looks even better on camera. I mean, it's still gross. Like, there's, no, there's not much save in the hood. The windshield is amazing. 
how much even the trunk or the back window is also pretty clean. Um, but yeah, there was just so much mold and algae just soaked up into the paint. It's a lot better. I don't mind touching it now. I probably just ruined it. Anyways. Next up on the channel is going to be pretty much fixing this interior situation. And uh, hopefully finding an engine for it and everything. And yeah, getting the ball rolling on this project. This was mostly just like a video to kind of show what we're doing with it and everything. So I hope you guys uh, stick around. Subscribe if you're not already. And uh, yeah. Hope you guys like the new project.